but we don't neglect essentials. Milk, for example. Or beer. Talking of beer, Salisbury is rich in old and quaint pubs. It is said that no one can decently survive a pint of good ale in every public house between the railway station, round the market square, up to the Milford Arms. is the Moonraker, that is what a Wiltshire man is called, the Moonraker. Well, let's go inside, and in the Moonraker's bar at the county hotel is a mural of the old story, and thereby hangs a tale. I do remember the night, for bright moonlight snow, bright as day it were, when Bert and I were carrying home a little keg of brandy, and what's the thing? The little keg had come a long way without nobody knowing. We'd had a good taste on it already. And we were happy like, and took the rough track by the river. When what's thing happened, all of a sudden, Bert went head over to it with a keg, and he rolled all down the bank right into the water. Well, no, there were nothing for it, but the fish out the keg, we are high racks, and we're lucky we had him with us too. We weren't going to throw away a good drop of brandy in the river, even if it were contraband. Then we seen him. Thick excise bloke on his arse, coming straight at us he were, nosy like, and not a bit friendly. So we went on raking, raking away, raking as if we were raking the moon, laughing like we were happy. But we weren't snow, not with thick excise bloke, riding right to us, and watching us. The was thing, it worked. Thick excise bloke thought we were mad, raking for the moon. Then he shook his head trod it off. Twere an ear go, Bert and I fished the keg out we are high racks and took no. And Bert and I do often laugh about it. Do you remember the night Bert the sigh when we went moon raking? <laughs> moon raking he to call it. <laughs> All right.